Amanda's Kitchen and I'll be doing a special presentation today for the Undiluted Love Retreat. Thank you so much Woman of God Latoya Grant for awarding me this opportunity. It's an indeed pleasure. So today I will be preparing for you some codfish fritters, some pak choy toast and fruit parfait. So I'll be starting with the Cutfish fritters in Jamaica with the saltfish fritters, you may know it as cutfish fritters. So in my bowl, I have a cup of flour and I have some saltfish or codfish that has already been boiled, you know, to get rid of the excess salt. So I'm just going to go ahead and pour that in. To that, I'm going to add my chopped seasonings and in here I have some onions, tomatoes and scotch bonnet peppers. Just move these out of the way. I'm just gonna mix that around. I'm gonna add a half a teaspoon of salt. And roughly a quarter teaspoon of black pepper. Quarter teaspoon of all purpose seasoning and a half cup of water. I'm just gonna mix that around just to get everything incorporated. We need a bit more water. Let's see. Yes, I'm gonna need a bit more water. So we mix that around. And by the way, I have my frying pot going with some oil being heated and ready for the spritters. And as I said, I'll be preparing some toast for you today. And I've already um, cooked the pak choy. And that was the pak choy with some carrots and tomatoes. So the pak choy was nicely prepared. I mean, you only need like three minutes to prepare it on the stove. All right, so I'm just gonna go over to the stove because this is well combined and is ready for our frying pot. All right, so join me over the stove. Go up to our stove and I'm just gonna go ahead and spoon in my mixture. I have the, the oil that is already hot. I'm just gonna go in, go in with my mixtures. You can make your, 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 your fritters bigger or smaller, it's really dependent on your liking and you want to allow these to get to a golden brown state before turning in jamaica people call or we call this stampango sour fish fritters you know it's kind of the go-to fritters when you think about fritters or appetizer when you go to some restaurants really. Alright, so four is in and we're gonna allow those to get to a roll and roll state and then you flip them. Now, the popcorn, as I said, was already prepared and it was just cut up and you add some carrots and tomatoes and onions 
just to get all the flavors in you add a little salt add a little black a little black pepper you know to bring up the taste all right so i have my bread in this uh tray or container right here and it's just it's gonna go in the toaster if your oven is on you can go ahead and put it in there um another if you don't like pop chow another option is a uh, kalaloo or spinach all right so i'm just gonna go ahead and spoon spoon the pop chow on the bread so this is a nice way to get your vegetables in keeping healthy right yes So you want to spread spread your vegetables nicely over your bread all right so you want to ensure that all your vegetables are spread on your bread I think that is good and in this plate I grated some cheddar cheese you can use whatever cheese you have as long as it is melt it melts so you just want to get those on top of your vegetables so it melts nicely and then I'm gonna put these in the toaster to go ahead for a few minutes and get all toasted all right so i'm just gonna move on over to the toaster to get these in and then i'll be back the bread is in the toaster hands washed um and while that is going i'm just gonna go ahead and get started with my heart phase Babe, you wanna come and help me? And you do one and I do one? Why? Come. Get busy, get busy. Get one of these glasses. So, I have some low fat yogurt. And I have some toasted coconut. And for my fruits, I have some grapes and kiwis and bananas. And I have some strawberry filling or strawberry sauce going on right here. What do I have to do now? I'm coming. Wouldn't it be a little bit easier to just call me when it's finished? So that I can, no, 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 no. I can't help you eat it. No. You have to participate so that you will enjoy it more, right? Yes, ma'am. Yes. All right. So, you have our glasses. Um, can I get a spoon? Any spoon? Yes. You want to have this camera? That's fine. So you're going to watch me and do what I do? Alright, cool. You can pass the microphone, please. Really? Really? Because you can't have the food just sitting here and nobody's eating it. Come on now. Alright, so we have our glasses here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and spoon in my yogurt. You're gonna do this. So as I, when I try, you try as well. You go ahead. Yeah, no stealing. So where's my spoon? I'm get get another spoon. Shh. And guys, if you hear that noise, that's actually the toaster over there that's making that noise. <laughs> Alright, so I have my glass and I have my yogurt. So, so are you going to go over so, so we can share the space together? Or is it that you don't want the persons to know that I can do this better than you? <laughs> Alright, let's go. 
So this is a competition? All right, Come on, let's, let's go. go. Let's do this. All right, so we have our yogurt. And I'm going to spoon in my yogurt. I'm not going to spoon in everything. Are you starting? So we have our yogurt and I'm, I'm going to spoon in my yogurt. Uh, we're, we're not going to spoon in everything. Uh, <laughs> and there's a reason for that, which we're going to tell you a little later on. <laughs> um, but we're just going to spoon in, you know, like that amount for right now. All right, so after that, I'm gonna go ahead and put in my strawberry filling to give it that red color. There you go. All right, so everyone, listen up now. In order to get the red color, what we're gonna do, we're gonna put in what we call strawberry filling. And what it is, it's filling with strawberry. <laughs> and what, 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 what we do here, we just basically, we create like a little circular design with that. I mean, let me just go around because you know, that's how us professional chefs do this thing, we we'll have to do it properly, and that's it. Okay. All right. All right, so I'm gonna go in with my toasted coconut. I'm just gonna drizzle that around. If you don't have toasted coconut, you can use nuts or, um, what that thing called? Uh, granola bar. Yeah, yeah, granola, granola bar. bar, yeah, that. Right. So you can't use like walnuts too? I said nuts, so peanuts, almonds, cashews, What's this called? Pecans. This is a parfait. No, this. Coconut flakes. All right, so guys, so listen now. The next thing that we're going to use, we're going to use our coconut flakes. And you don't have to use coconut flakes. You can actually use nuts um, and and um, and more nuts <laughs> if you want to. Did you say coconut and more nuts? Um, coca, coconut flakes. This is coconut flakes. Toasted coconut flakes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's toasted. All right, I'm going to go in with my fruits. I have kiwis. So as we know what we're doing, we're doing our parfait and we've already added our yogurt, we've already added our strawberry filling, we've already added our coconut flakes and now what we're going to do, we're going to add our fruits on top so that you get that fullness when you actually bite it. So first we're going to start out with our kiwi and the kiwi is the... The kiwi is the green thing here and it's a fruit and we're going to just put just enough on it so that we can have a leftover and then we're going to put a little um, grapes around that and then banana but if you have other things you know like if you have like pear if you have um strawberry um walnut no not walnut just other fruits you know you, you can kind of mix it up okay all right so that's done so what we're gonna do now is go in with some more strawberries over that strawberry filling. And put on my to please. Mm -hmm. And then go in with your yogurt. Guys, you remember that we left some of the yogurt earlier, right? Did you know that this was the reason why we're, we're, we had to leave, leave some of the yogurt? Yeah, guys, I didn't know either. I'm, I'm just being honest. <laughs> well, but, but babe, what you really want to do is just layer so you, you get to see all the like layers. Like a cheesecake? Like layer, like a cheesecake? Um, If you want to use that term, fine. So you just want to layer it and you show your fruits because as you can see, you have your yogurt and you have your strawberries to give it that nice boost of red to pop the color. So you have your strawberries and your toasted, toasted flakes and your pecans, not pecans, uh, kiwis and grapes. All right, so I'm just going to top all of that off with my yogurt. All right, guys, if you pay attention to this, uh, you will see the different colors or the different color variations that pop in. You know, we started with our yogurt, which was flat. No, not flat. It went in first 
and then we followed with our red jelly, jelly majiggy kind of ready red strawberry thing. And there, right, so I'm just gonna wipe around this. I have to do that too. Um, I mean, it's no, up to your men. presentation. Us men, we don't, we don't do any kind of wipe up after. <laughs> what are you talking about now? Are we talking about? Are you done? Huh? Are you done? Are you done with your parfait? Are you pleased with yours? No. Are um, you gonna leave it? No. We're gonna add a little bit more of our coconut shredders, shredded, shredders, shredded coconut. Shredded coconut. We're gonna put some more. Have you used a spoon? Not necessarily. All right. Let's see. Us men do things a little bit differently, right? Still getting the job done, but remember, guys, we're gonna put a little bit of those fruits on top, just to top it off. It's almost like a fruit basket, right? Sure. See, I think I need to leave the camera life and come over to this, <laughs> to this baking and cuisine and kitchen, guys. Let us know if you think I can make it in the kitchen here. Let us know. Can I put some online to please? No, 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 no. I'm You're tired. Me out. Come. I'm tired. Come here, you go. I'm just gonna squeeze some more of the red just to put it in the again in the middle. Just a little just to pop the color. <laughs> Are you gonna put banana in here? Yeah, I'm gonna put banana. Of course. Can you pass my cup over there, please? Here what? Hmm? Stop eating stuff. Just Okay. And just put some of the red in the, the middle right there. And guys, <laughs> be honest. Which one of us all looks better? Mine! I'm, I'm gonna make a little heart in mine now because I know to do that now, you know, boom, heart. <laughs> that's not so hard. Okay, that's enough. I think I think you you're having too much fun. So push push these over. Alright. I'm gonna thanks for having me on the program. No, we're gonna judge. We're gonna vote. We're gonna vote. Guys. We all know that all the ladies are We're gonna, gonna choose vote, your thing over mine. We're gonna vote. This is mine. This is mine. All right. All right, guys. Hold on. No, hey, hey. I'll introduce mine. <laughs> oh, guys, let me tell you what I'm going for now because you you get people wondering how come Amanda's won't look structured. It all depends on what you're going for. You can go for <laughs> consistency or you can go for inconsistency. In my term, you know, this is just what I'm feeling. So. <laughs> Yeah. Alright. Good job, but I think that's okay. Don't you? Don't you agree? We will leave that to everybody else right. to decide. Good job, Thank you. Mm -hmm. Alright, so our parfaits are done. I'm just gonna go ahead and check on our toast to see how far along that is. Alright, so I'm gonna put the parfaits in the fridge just to set a bit based on your Sure.
So that's our toast. And this is our hot fish. Go on to the fridge for the let me just go on over to the fridge for the party all right so there you have it on diluted love retreat or toast fritters or pot fish fritters and or party i hope you enjoyed this presentation this session and trust that you will enjoy this preparation um, and all the best with your marriage and relationships have fun have a wonderful retreat and once again woman of god latoya grand thank you so much for having me and to all your guests thank you so much for having me yeah, because I look good on camera, guys. So I'm, I'm just coming to support. Her and I want to thank does, you know? my amazing husband for videoing this for me. He, he did an amazing job. Not with this, but with the camera. All right, I deserve that one. Yeah, I don't. I, <laughs> Guys if, I, we end? guys, if I start talking, <laughs> this video will never finish. So I'm not going to start talking, but just enjoy marriage. Um, have fun. Remember the fun part of it. And just enjoy each other. Yeah. Have fun. Be each other's best friend. Yes. And I'm not going to start, guys. I promise. <laughs> All right. God bless you. All right, guys. God bless you. Take care. Bye.